Imagine waking up every day with the unwavering belief that luck is not just a chance occurrence, but a deliberate creation within your grasp. What if I told you that you hold the key to unlocking a world where fortunate opportunities abound, and serendipity is not just a fleeting moment, but a constant companion? Welcome to the journey of becoming the luckiest version of yourself. A journey where mindfulness, curiosity, persistence, and a positive outlook converge to transform your reality. Are you ready to rewrite the narrative of luck and seize control of your destiny? In a world often dominated by the notion of luck as a capricious force beyond our control, the idea of actively cultivating our own fortune may seem like a whimsical fantasy. Yet, nestled within the realm of psychology, philosophy, and the experiences of individuals who have defied the odds, lies a treasure trove of insights into the nature of luck and how we can harness its power. At its core, luck is more than mere chance. It's a fusion of preparation, mindset, and seizing opportunities as they arise. To embark on the journey of mastering luck, we must first shift our perspective from passive recipients to proactive architects of our own destiny. Embracing the present moment is a foundational step on this journey. Often, our minds dwell in the past, ruminating over missed opportunities, or race ahead to an uncertain future filled with worries and what-ifs. However, luck resides in the here and now. By cultivating mindfulness and fully immersing ourselves in the present, we open ourselves up to the myriad possibilities that surround us, increasing our chances of encountering fortunate circumstances. Curiosity serves as another key ingredient in the alchemy of luck. When we approach life with a sense of wonder and openness, we become more attuned to the subtle signals and opportunities that others may overlook. Curiosity fuels exploration and experimentation, leading us down unexpected paths that may ultimately lead to serendipitous encounters and breakthroughs. Persistence is the backbone of luck. While setbacks and challenges are inevitable, those who persevere in the face of adversity often find themselves rewarded with fortuitous outcomes. By maintaining a resilient spirit and refusing to succumb to defeat, we position ourselves as prime candidates for luck to favor. Furthermore, luck thrives in the fertile soil of positivity and optimism. Adopting a mindset of abundance rather than scarcity opens our eyes to the abundance of opportunities that surround us. By reframing setbacks as opportunities for growth and viewing challenges as stepping stones to success, we cultivate an aura of positivity that attracts favorable outcomes like moths to a flame. However, becoming the luckiest person alive requires more than just passive optimism. It demands proactive action. Taking calculated risks and stepping outside our comfort zones are essential ingredients in the recipe for luck. By daring to pursue our dreams with unwavering determination and courage, we create the conditions for luck to manifest in our lives. Moreover, luck is not a solitary endeavor. It thrives in the fertile ground of community and collaboration. Building strong relationships and nurturing a supportive network of allies amplifies our capacity to attract fortuitous opportunities and weather life storms together. In essence, becoming the luckiest person alive is not an elusive dream reserved for a select few. It's a journey that each of us can embark upon by embracing the principles of mindfulness, curiosity, persistence, positivity, and action. By transforming our mindset and behaviors, we can unlock the secrets of luck and rewrite the narrative of our lives. So, let us set forth on this voyage of discovery, guided by the belief that luck is not merely a roll of the dice, but a tapestry woven from the threads of our thoughts actions, and intentions. Lesson 1. Embrace the Present In the pursuit of becoming the luckiest human alive, the first lesson is foundational. Embrace the present moment. This principle underscores the essence of mindfulness, a practice deeply rooted in various philosophical and spiritual traditions, now widely recognized for its benefits in modern psychology and self-improvement. The present moment serves as the canvas upon which the brushstrokes of our lives are painted. It's the juncture where past experiences intersect with future aspirations and where the magic of existence unfolds in real time. Yet, it's all too easy to get swept away by the currents of nostalgia or anticipation, losing sight of the richness and potential inherent in the here and now. Mindfulness acts as a beacon, guiding us back to the present moment with gentle persistence, 
It involves cultivating a heightened awareness of our thoughts, emotions, bodily sensations, and surroundings without judgment or attachment. By anchoring ourselves in the present, we become more attuned to the subtle nuances of life, the fleeting moments, the whispered insights, the serendipitous encounters that often bear the hallmark of luck. Imagine standing on a shoreline, waves gently lapping at your feet as the sun dips below the horizon. In that moment, there's no room for regrets about the past or worries about the future. There's only the symphony of sights, sounds, and sensations unfolding before you. This is the essence of embracing the present, a state of radical presence that allows us to immerse ourselves fully in the tapestry of existence. From a practical standpoint, mindfulness serves as a gateway to recognizing and seizing opportunities that abound in our daily lives. When we're fully engaged in the moment, our senses sharpen and our awareness expands, enabling us to discern the subtle cues and openings that others might overlook. It could be the chance encounter with a stranger that blossoms into a lifelong friendship or the sudden spark of inspiration that ignites a creative project. These moments of serendipity are often the seeds from which luck blossoms, and they're more likely to take root when we're attuned to the present moment. Moreover, embracing the present fosters a state of openness and receptivity, a fertile ground for luck to flourish. When we let go of preconceived notions and expectations, we create space for the unexpected to unfold. This doesn't mean relinquishing all control or forsaking planning. Rather, it's about striking a delicate balance between intentionality and surrender, between effort and acceptance. It's in this dance of engagement and detachment that the magic of luck often reveals itself. Mindfulness practices vary in form and intensity, but they all share a common thread, the cultivation of present moment awareness. Whether it's through focused breathing exercises, mindful walking, or formal meditation, the goal is to train the mind to remain anchored in the here and now. With patience and practice, these techniques become second nature, allowing us to navigate life's ups and downs with greater grace and resilience. Furthermore, Embracing the present is not just about being mindful of our own inner landscape, it's also about attuning ourselves to the world around us. By fully engaging with our surroundings, whether it's the chirping of birds, the rustle of leaves, or the laughter of children, we deepen our connection to the rich tapestry of life. In doing so, we open ourselves up to the beauty and wonder that abound in every moment, enriching our experience of being alive. In essence, to embrace the present, is to live with a sense of aliveness and receptivity, a readiness to embrace whatever life throws our way. It's about releasing the grip of the past and the pull of the future and surrendering to the infinite possibilities of the present moment. By cultivating mindfulness, we not only enhance our mental and emotional well-being, but also create the conditions for luck to find its way to us. After all, luck is not just a matter of chance. It's a product of our awareness, our openness, and our willingness to embrace the magic of the present moment. So let us heed the call to presence and embark on this journey of radical engagement, knowing that the door to luck opens from the inside, and it's through embracing the present that we unlock its boundless potential. Lesson 2. Cultivate Curiosity Curiosity, often hailed as the spark of innovation and discovery, is also a potent catalyst for attracting luck and uncovering unforeseen opportunities. Rooted in the insatiable desire to explore, question, and engage with the world, curiosity propels us beyond the confines of the familiar opening doors to serendipitous encounters and creative solutions to life's challenges. At its essence, curiosity is a mindset, an attitude of openness and receptivity to the unknown. It's the willingness to venture into uncharted territory, to ask questions that challenge the status quo, and to seek out experiences that expand our horizons. In cultivating curiosity, we position ourselves as perpetual learners, constantly on the lookout for new insights and perspectives that can enrich our lives. But how do we cultivate curiosity in our daily lives? It begins with a shift in perspective, an acknowledgement that there's always more to learn, discover, and explore. This mindset encourages us to embrace the unknown with a sense of wonder and excitement, rather than fear or apprehension. Instead of shying away from unfamiliar topics or experiences, we lean into them, recognizing the potential for growth and discovery that they offer. 
One practical strategy for cultivating curiosity is to actively seek out new experiences and knowledge. This could involve anything from reading books on diverse subjects, attending lectures and workshops, or immersing yourself in different cultures and environments. By exposing ourselves to a wide range of ideas and perspectives, we broaden our understanding of the world and open ourselves up to unexpected opportunities. Mindful observation is another powerful tool for nurturing curiosity. By paying attention to the details of our surroundings, the sights, sounds, and sensations, we become more attuned to the subtle nuances of life. This heightened awareness not only enriches our experience of the present moment, but also enables us to spot opportunities that might otherwise go unnoticed. Whether it's noticing a unique pattern in the behavior of customers at a local cafe, or observing a gap in the market for a new product or service, mindful observation can be a source of inspiration and insight. Moreover, fostering curiosity requires a willingness to embrace uncertainty and discomfort. The fear of failure or looking foolish often stifles our natural curiosity, causing us to play it safe and stick to the familiar. However, true growth and discovery lie on the other side of our comfort zones. By pushing past our fears and embracing the unknown, we create space for luck to flourish and for serendipity to strike. In essence, cultivating curiosity is about adopting a mindset of lifelong learning and exploration. It's about approaching each day with a sense of curiosity and wonder, eager to uncover the hidden gems and unexpected opportunities that lie in wait. By nurturing our innate curiosity, we not only enrich our own lives, but also contribute to the collective pool of knowledge and innovation that drives progress and change. Furthermore, curiosity is not just a solo endeavor. It thrives in environments that encourage collaboration and exchange of ideas. By surrounding ourselves with curious individuals who share our passion for exploration and discovery, we create a fertile ground for creativity and innovation to flourish. Through meaningful dialogue and collaboration, we can amplify our collective curiosity and unlock new realms of possibility. In conclusion, cultivating curiosity is a powerful means of attracting luck and uncovering opportunities in our lives. By fostering a mindset of openness, exploration, and lifelong learning, we position ourselves to embrace the unknown with enthusiasm and curiosity. Through mindful observation, exposure to new experiences, and a willingness to push past our comfort zones, we create space for serendipity to thrive and for luck to find its way to us. So let us embrace curiosity as a guiding principle in our lives, knowing that it is not just a path to personal growth and fulfillment, but also a gateway to a world of infinite possibilities. Lesson 3. Persistence Pays Off In the pursuit of becoming the luckiest person alive, one crucial lesson stands out. Persistence pays off. While luck may appear as sudden strokes of fortune to the untrained eye, a closer examination often reveals that behind every stroke of luck lies a foundation of relentless effort, unwavering commitment, and sheer determination. The stories of successful individuals, from inventors and entrepreneurs to artists and athletes, echo this universal truth. Hard work is the soil from which the seeds of luck sprout and flourish. The adage, the more you sweat, the luckier you get, encapsulates this principle succinctly. It underscores the direct correlation between diligent effort and fortuitous outcomes, reminding us that luck favors those who refuse to yield to adversity and persist in the pursuit of their goals. Indeed, beneath every tale of overnight success lies a narrative of unseen struggle, perseverance through setbacks, and an unyielding resolve to forge ahead despite the odds. Encouraging individuals to adopt a mindset of persistence requires instilling in them the belief that every obstacle is an opportunity in disguise, and every setback is a stepping stone toward success. It's about cultivating resilience, a willingness to bounce back from failure stronger and more determined than before. This resilience is not born out of blind optimism, but is grounded in a deep-seated belief in one's ability to overcome challenges through perseverance and hard work. Furthermore, persistence necessitates a long-term perspective, a willingness to endure short-term discomfort for the promise of long-term gain. It's about setting ambitious yet achievable goals, breaking them down into manageable steps, and staying the course even when progress seems slow or non-existent. 
by maintaining focus on the bigger picture and refusing to be deterred by temporary setbacks, individuals position themselves to capitalize on opportunities when they arise. A key aspect of cultivating persistence is the ability to adapt and learn from failure. Rather than viewing setbacks as insurmountable obstacles, successful individuals see them as valuable learning experiences that provide insights into what works and what doesn't. This adaptive persistence ensures that when opportunities present themselves, individuals are not only prepared to seize them, but also equipped with the knowledge and skills to make the most of them. Moreover, persistence involves seeking feedback and embracing constructive criticism as catalysts for growth and improvement. By soliciting input from mentors, peers, and trusted advisors, individuals gain valuable insights into their strengths and weaknesses, allowing them to refine their approach and make necessary adjustments along the way. This willingness to learn from others and continuously iterate on one's efforts is a hallmark of persistent individuals and a key driver of long-term success. In essence, the essence of persistence in the quest for luck lies in cultivating a mindset of grit, resilience, and adaptability. It's about recognizing that luck is not something that simply happens to you, but something that you actively cultivate through unwavering commitment and relentless effort. By embracing the principle that the more you sweat, the luckier you get, individuals set themselves on a path toward achieving their goals and realizing their dreams, no matter how daunting the journey may seem. In conclusion, persistence is not just a virtue. It's a powerful tool for attracting luck and unlocking opportunities in life. By persevering through adversity, maintaining a long-term perspective, and continuously learning and adapting, individuals position themselves to capitalize on opportunities when they arise. So let us embrace the principle that the more we sweat, the luckier we get, and embark on our journey toward becoming the luckiest person alive with unwavering determination and resilience. Lesson 4. A positive outlook attracts positive outcomes. In the pursuit of becoming the luckiest person alive, one of the most potent tools at our disposal is a positive outlook. This principle rests upon the understanding that our perceptions and attitudes play a significant role in shaping our experiences and the opportunities that come our way. Optimism isn't just a feel-good mindset. It's a powerful magnet for fortuitous events and serendipitous encounters. The correlation between a positive outlook and increased luck is profound, rooted in how our mindset shapes our interactions with the world. Optimistic individuals possess a unique lens through which they view the world. They tend to notice and seize opportunities more readily than their pessimistic counterparts, not out of coincidence, but as a result of their predisposition towards seeing possibilities even in the face of adversity. This mindset empowers them to view challenges as temporary hurdles rather than insurmountable barriers, fueling persistence and resilience, the cornerstone traits for creating one's own luck. Furthermore, optimism is contagious. It exudes a magnetic energy that attracts people and opportunities alike. In environments where optimism prevails, collaborations flourish, creativity thrives, and doors to new possibilities swing open effortlessly. By radiating positivity, individuals not only enhance their own luck, but also contribute to the collective luck of those around them, creating a virtuous cycle of positivity and opportunity. To harness the power of positivity in attracting luck, it's essential to adopt strategies that cultivate and maintain a positive outlook. One such strategy is the practice of gratitude. By consciously acknowledging and appreciating the blessings in one's life, individuals shift their focus from what's lacking to what's abundant, fostering a sense of contentment and well-being. This habit not only enhances mental resilience, but also primes the mind to recognize and embrace opportunities as they arise. Additionally, reframing setbacks is crucial for maintaining a positive outlook in the face of adversity. Instead of viewing failures and obstacles as insurmountable roadblocks, they can be seen as valuable lessons and opportunities for growth. This shift in perspective transforms setbacks into stepping stones on the path to success, minimizing discouragement and keeping motivation intact. By reframing challenges as temporary setbacks rather than permanent defeats, individuals remain open to new opportunities and possibilities. Visualization is another powerful tool for fostering a positive outlook and attracting luck. 
by vividly imagining oneself achieving goals and experiencing desired outcomes, individuals create a mental blueprint for success. This mental rehearsal not only boosts confidence, but also primes the mind to recognize and seize opportunities that align with their envisioned future. As the imagined reality feels increasingly attainable, individuals become more proactive in pursuing opportunities that lead them closer to their goals. Moreover, surrounding oneself with positive influences, whether it be supportive friends, mentors, or role models, can significantly impact one's mindset and outlook. Positive social circles act as a source of encouragement, inspiration, and support, helping individuals stay resilient in the face of challenges and setbacks. By surrounding themselves with positivity, individuals create an environment that nurtures their optimism and empowers them to attract luck and opportunities. In conclusion, the connection between a positive outlook and the ability to attract favorable outcomes is undeniable. By adopting strategies that foster optimism, resilience, and a forward-looking perspective, individuals can significantly enhance their capacity to create and capitalize on lucky opportunities. The journey towards becoming the luckiest person alive, therefore, is as much about cultivating a positive mental landscape as it is about taking concrete steps towards one's goals. By embracing the power of positivity, individuals can transform their lives and manifest the luck and success they desire. Lesson 5. Actionable Steps Towards Attracting Luck In the quest to become the luckiest person alive, it's essential to focus on concrete strategies that can significantly enhance one's ability to attract luck. Luck isn't merely a matter of chance. It's a product of proactive actions, positive attitudes, and resilience in the face of challenges. By taking deliberate steps to cultivate these qualities, individuals can increase their likelihood of encountering fortunate opportunities and experiences in their lives. First and foremost, being proactive is paramount. Rather than passively waiting for luck to come knocking, proactive individuals take control of their destinies by setting clear goals, making plans, and taking consistent action to achieve them. Proactivity involves stepping out of one's comfort zone and actively seeking out new experiences and opportunities. Whether it's initiating a conversation with a stranger, enrolling in a course to learn a new skill, or launching a project that has been put on hold, proactive individuals are constantly on the lookout for ways to expand their horizons and create opportunities for themselves. By being proactive, individuals increase their chances of encountering situations that can be deemed lucky. They position themselves as active participants in their own lives rather than passive bystanders waiting for fate to intervene. This proactive mindset not only attracts opportunities, but also empowers individuals to capitalize on them when they arise, turning potential into reality. Counting blessings is another powerful practice for attracting luck. Gratitude shifts one's focus from what is lacking in life to the abundance that already exists. By acknowledging and appreciating the blessings, both big and small, individuals cultivate a positive outlook that naturally attracts more positive experiences and opportunities. A daily gratitude practice, such as keeping a gratitude journal or simply reflecting on three things to be grateful for each day, can work wonders in transforming one's perception and mindset. Learning from challenges is equally crucial in the journey towards attracting luck. Every setback or failure is an opportunity for growth and learning. By adopting a growth mindset, individuals view challenges as stepping stones to success rather than insurmountable obstacles. This mindset fosters resilience, the ability to bounce back from setbacks and continue moving forward despite adversity. When individuals approach challenges with a learning mindset, they extract valuable lessons that can inform their future actions and decisions ultimately increasing their chances of encountering lucky breaks. Taking personal responsibility for one's actions is the foundation upon which these steps are built. It involves acknowledging one's role in both successes and failures, understanding that choices and actions have a direct impact on one's life's trajectory. By taking ownership of their lives, individuals empower themselves to make intentional choices and take deliberate actions that align with their goals and desires. This sense of agency and responsibility is a powerful driver of luck, as it enables individuals to actively create the circumstances and opportunities they desire. To encourage viewers to integrate these actionable steps into their lives, 
It's essential to provide practical tips and real-life examples that illustrate these principles in action. Sharing stories of individuals who have successfully attracted luck through proactivity, gratitude, and resilience can serve as inspiration and motivation. Additionally, offering simple exercises or challenges to help viewers practice these steps in their daily lives can facilitate the transition from theory to practice. In essence, attracting luck is about more than just wishing for good fortune. It's about taking deliberate actions that increase the likelihood of encountering lucky breaks. By being proactive, practicing gratitude, learning from challenges, and taking personal responsibility, individuals can actively contribute to creating a life where luck is not just a chance occurrence, but a natural consequence of their actions and attitudes. By implementing these actionable steps, individuals can pave the way for a more fortunate and fulfilling life. Lesson 6. The Power of a Luck Journal In the pursuit of becoming the luckiest person alive, harnessing the power of a luck journal can be a transformative practice. A luck journal, essentially a diary dedicated to recording instances of luck, serendipity, and small wins, serves as more than just a log of happy coincidences. It becomes a tool for cultivating a heightened awareness of luck's presence in our lives, ultimately leading to increased recognition and seizing of opportunities. The concept of a luck journal revolves around the simple act of noting down fortunate events or positive moments throughout one's day. By committing these instances to paper, individuals not only create a tangible record of luck, but also cultivate a mindset that is attuned to recognizing and appreciating the positive aspects of life. In the midst of the hustle and bustle of daily routines, it's easy to overlook the small blessings and strokes of luck that pepper our days. However, by actively documenting these moments, individuals train themselves to pay closer attention to the positive occurrences that might otherwise go unnoticed. One of the primary psychological benefits of maintaining a luck journal is its ability to counteract the negativity bias, a phenomenon where negative experiences tend to have a greater impact on one's psychological state than neutral or positive experiences. By consciously focusing on and recording moments of luck and gratitude, Individuals can rebalance this bias, fostering a more optimistic outlook on life. This shift towards positivity not only improves mental well-being but also serves as a magnet for attracting more positive experiences, creating a virtuous cycle of luck and gratitude. Moreover, keeping a luck journal can lead to a fundamental shift in mindset, a transition from a passive stance of waiting for luck to happen to an active engagement in recognizing and creating it. This shift aligns with the principles of the Law of Attraction, which posits that positive thoughts and expectations attract corresponding positive experiences. By consistently focusing on and acknowledging lucky events, individuals prime their minds to expect and thus attract more such occurrences. This heightened expectation can subconsciously guide one's actions and decisions towards more favorable outcomes, effectively manufacturing luck through a blend of perception and action. Beyond its cognitive benefits, the act of journaling itself carries therapeutic value. Serving as a reflective practice, it allows individuals to process their day, celebrate their achievements, and set intentions for the future. Regular journaling can increase gratitude, reduce stress, and improve overall emotional well-being, all of which contribute to a mindset that is more receptive to noticing and capitalizing on lucky opportunities. Practically, starting a luck journal is straightforward. It can be as simple as jotting down one or two things one feels fortunate about each day. These entries could encompass significant events, such as receiving unexpected good news or narrowly avoiding an accident, as well as everyday moments, such as enjoying a beautiful sunset or sharing a meaningful conversation. Over time, the luck journal becomes not only a repository of fortunate events, but also a tangible reminder of the abundance and positivity that surround us often awaiting acknowledgement just beneath the surface of our awareness. The closing reflection beautifully encapsulates the essence of the transformative journey we've embarked upon. It underscores the profound lessons we've explored and emphasizes the actionable steps necessary to integrate them into our daily lives. Let's delve deeper into the significance of each lesson and how it contributes to the overarching goal of becoming the luckiest version of ourselves. Firstly, 
Embracing the present moment lays the foundation for recognizing and seizing opportunities that might otherwise go unnoticed. By cultivating mindfulness and awareness, individuals become attuned to the richness of their surroundings and the possibilities that lie within each moment. This lesson teaches us the importance of slowing down, savoring the present, and being fully engaged in the here and now. It's about living life with intentionality and openness, ready to embrace the unexpected twists and turns that lead to fortuitous outcomes. Cultivating curiosity emerges as another key theme in our journey towards luck. Curiosity serves as a guiding light, leading us to explore new avenues, question the status quo, and uncover hidden opportunities. By nurturing a sense of wonder and inquisitiveness, individuals expand their horizons and invite serendipity into their lives. This lesson encourages us to approach life with a sense of adventure, eagerly seeking out novel experiences and perspectives that spark creativity and innovation. Persistence, as encapsulated in the mantra, the more you sweat, the luckier you get, underscores the importance of perseverance and resilience in the face of challenges. Luck is not merely a matter of chance. It's a byproduct of relentless effort and dedication. This lesson teaches us the value of grit and determination, urging us to press on even when the odds seem stacked against us. It's about staying the course, weathering the storms, and trusting that our efforts will ultimately lead to favorable outcomes. A positive outlook emerges as a powerful force in attracting luck. Our perceptions and attitudes shape our experiences and the opportunities that come our way. By cultivating optimism and gratitude, individuals create a fertile ground for luck to flourish. This lesson teaches us to focus on the abundance in our lives rather than dwelling on what we lack. It's about shifting our perspective from scarcity to abundance, from negativity to positivity, and from passivity to active engagement in the creation of our own fortune. Actionable steps toward attracting luck provide individuals with practical strategies for manifesting their desires. From being proactive and counting blessings to learning from challenges and maintaining a luck journal, these steps empower individuals to take control of their destinies and actively shape their reality. This lesson underscores the importance of intentional action and mindfulness in the pursuit of luck. It's about making conscious choices, setting clear intentions, and aligning our actions with our goals. The concept of a luck journal serves as a tangible tool for cultivating awareness of luck and fostering a luck-oriented mindset. By documenting fortunate events and moments of gratitude, individuals create a reservoir of positive experiences that serve as a source of inspiration and encouragement. This lesson teaches us the value of reflection and introspection in our journey towards luck. It's about acknowledging the blessings that enrich our lives and embracing a mindset of abundance and possibility. As we reflect on these transformative lessons, the call to action becomes clear. It's time to integrate these principles into our daily lives and actively work towards becoming the architects of our fortune. This journey is not a solitary one. It's a collective endeavor fueled by shared experiences, insights, and support. By coming together as a community, we can inspire and uplift one another as we navigate the unpredictable waters of life. In conclusion, the path to becoming the luckiest version of ourselves is within our reach. It requires us to embrace the present moment, cultivate curiosity, persistence, and a positive outlook, and take actionable steps towards attracting luck. By integrating these lessons into our lives and supporting one another along the way, we can unlock the secrets of becoming the luckiest person alive. So let's embark on this transformative journey together with open hearts and minds, ready to embrace the abundance and possibility that await us. The power to make luck a choice, not a chance, lies within each of us.